Fantasy, and I will be reviewing 31 horror movies, one each day of October, because horror movies are the best thing about Halloween. The film that I'll be reviewing today was made in 2006, it's a Spanish film, and it translates to The Baby Room. It wasn't a gore film or anything, it messed with your mind, and it kind of really freaked my mind out. It's about this um, husband and wife that have a child, and they move into a new house. And then they start hearing stuff on the baby monitor. And it turns out that there's some kind of alternate reality that's also living in the house with them. But it's like, you can only see it with like a camera or a monitor like in the mirror and then he starts fooling around with it and he goes into that alternate universe like he goes through the door and he goes through their universe which is him and he ends up murdering his wife and he, it's like the evil him I guess it's like an evil alternate reality him like what if he killed his wife well, since he opens that door, that door becomes open to his universe. It's a really good movie. I mean, I don't want to give too much away, but it, it's pretty scary. It, it will mess with your mind. It pretty much messed with my mind. I, I really don't know how I'm going to sleep tonight after watching that movie. It was kind of horrific. It, it was scary. And it, it did have subtitles, but... If you're a film person, I don't think subtitles should bother you. I actually like subtitles. It's better than dubbing. Dubbing just looks fake most of the time. But, um, I've never... I think this is the first... No, it's the second Spanish horror movie I've watched. I'm pretty sure. Because the first one that I watched was the Spanish version of Dracula. Which which is a really good film. But, um, I was really surprised because... Most newer horror movies that I watch, I don't really like. I like, like, older ones a lot. But this one really impressed me a lot. Like, most foreign horror films are still pretty good. They're really good films. Um, I'm so glad that I randomly came up with it on... on no! I was just going through the horror section, and I just clicked on one. And that's the one that I watched. It's, it's pretty short. It runs, like, an hour and a half. Um, which I think is the perfect length for that film because lots of films seem to drag on, they seem to carry on, but this one didn't. Uh, it was pretty good with the keeping you on the edge of your seat factor. I would I would really recommend it. I'd recommend it to any horror, horror buff out there. Um, out of five stars, I'd give it four and a half stars. It was pretty good. It, it might be, it's probably in my top 50 arm.